Guys, welcome back. It's Robert I here, your Tekken Games Crusader, and we have a package from Pro2 VR. This was sent for review and content coverage, so no money changed hands or anything, just to let you know. And I am going to provide my honest, complete feedback for what is contained within, as always, no sort of uh, compensation for positive or more promoted feedback will ever be permitted by my channel or content. So let's go ahead and take a look and see what it says here on the outside of the box. Hello, fellow gamer. Thank you for reading this. You're welcome. As gamers ourselves, we are always aiming to increase your fun and get the most out of virtual reality. Since 2016, we design products to enhance your VR sessions and your immersion. You know we favor efficiency over cumbersome aesthetic elements. That's why our peripherals are optimized for tracking, gameplay, and adaptability. This minimalist approach provides you comfort while boosting your performances. Whatever you are a casual or a professional player, our accessories evolve as your potential reveals itself. Our deepest wish is to carry you through your VR journey and bring you to the next level. Have fun. Feel the game. Pro2 VR team. So, feel the game. Same thing in French. On the back. More product. Ooh. That's kind of cool looking. I like that. Not going to joke. It's, I really like that. Wouldn't mind getting my hands on finding out what that thing is. That looks like the uh, Provolver or the pistol version. There's the Pro Saber. And here is the gun stock. This is a different version controller of what I have. And then there's the original Pro Tubes for Beat Saber. So, that's the basic Pro Tube VR Mag Tube, I believe, or the carbon version. It's see what we have here so we do know oh okay uh, anything they send me is going to be for the oculus quest 2 currently anyways my housemate he has a uh, valve index but uh, it's uh, a little bit more involving than what I care for. I like the uh, portability of the Quest 2 and the versatility for being able to use wirelessly or wired or wirelessly on PC. So, Pro2 VR. Hello, I'm Igor. War Igor. Long story short, thank you. If you have more time, let me tell you about the great adventure of your parcel. Your product was crafted in the Dwarven Forges of Erebor, but it was stolen. I embarked on a quest, and it's in the Mountain of Fate that I snatched your package from the hands of a horrible, hairless hobbit. The parcel comes from my favorite store on the Citadel. My <laughs> friends, lovingly, and with all due respect packed your order, and placed it in delica delicately inside. 
Then we entrusted your package to Planet Express, which brought it to you despite the thousands of parsecs that separated you. Now, with hope you get the most out of your accessory, again, thank you for your purchase. Finally, we concluded a deal with the Navi to preserve Pandora's trees. To find our instructions, follow the path of the QR code on the right, or reach the address down below. QR code for the manual. Protuvr.com forward slash en forward slash sav er, question mark step equals four. A problem or question, feel free to contact our support or ask your question to our Discord community. Disclaimers, if you ordered a product with magnets, the magnet can interfere with pacemaker and defibrillator. Neodymium and magnet are breakable. Sharp pieces can be projected. Electromagnetic field can damage objects like TV, hard drive, credit card, etc. You ordered a product with batteries. Do not charge if damaged. Do not approach the product heat source. If you must dispose the product, use specific collectors for the batteries. We decline all responsibilities in case of wrong assembly or wrong use. Got it. Okay, so... This looks like the ProTube VR Protas for the Oculus Quest 2. It's pretty neat looking. So that is a... Uh, 3D printed rubber. Here is the ProTube Pro Grip straps. Just like I have on my Quest 2 controllers already. So to save some. Ooh, I like that white. Oh, wow. It's got a banded, flexible TPU 3D printed layer on the inside of it so it doesn't scratch anything. People thinking that, oh no, if this is just like cheap stuff or flexible. You can get a little bit of squeeze into it, but it's pretty solid. I love their design. The only sticker I got in the box seems to... Uh... Oh, there's a sticker. Haha! <laughs> Two stickers. We got Eeyore sticker and the logo sticker. Here is some wrist straps and some hardware to utilize... Our Quest 2 Cups. With other products. So now that gives me... A different set that I can use on the ProTube VR Force tube. I think it's about time for uh, replacement foam here. It's definitely gotten some crushing because whenever I use it for contractors or onward, I definitely apply pressure.
Because <laughs> the way that this works is, you know, this is a uh, impedance motor. And it doesn't use haptics. It uses pressure for forcing this out and against your shoulder. So you get feedback off of the gun when you're using it. So, this is the carbon tube. As you can see, this is the red accent. This uh, belonged to my housemate, Bounty V, who has multiple products from ProTube VR, as he does do some uh, administrative and other assignments for them. So this is not my own, but I am privileged enough and grateful to get to use it. So taking a closer look here, there's the neodymium magnet. And this is actually bolted and screwed together. This is a solid piece right here. It doesn't move. But this part does. That's really cool. I suppose also if you had a rail system, you could use the rail system through here as well. Like if you have a, uh, a simulator cockpit or any sort of other configurations to use. Where I don't though, it does have the base of it here, if you take a look. This is an adhesive pad. That you just can mount it to your desk. So let's go ahead and grab our controllers. So we don't have to take these straps off again. We're going to just undo the bottom. Where these are already attached. really impressed with the color of white that is on these too. It's really nice. Okay, so here's our replacement right here let's go ahead and lock that in So if you really wanted to, you could leave this attached right at the bottom.
where I have my straps opposites. We'll go ahead, and this is the left side. This is the right side. And get the strap out of here. here like that As you can see we have the left side That one right there. There we go. Let's go ahead, line up our panel again. this back in this slot here kind of wish that these were uh, silicone buckles but I mean your hands not really touching it the way that these are designed so Definitely got to loosen it though. I got large hands. There we go. So what do you use a protest for? Well, as the name entails, if you're familiar with games that have flight to them, or tank games like Battlezone, Elite Dangerous, things of that sort, basically what it will be is your flight controls. Just like... Uh, the name and tells there are things that uh, that uh, controllers for console and PC called ho a HOTAS, and what a HOTAS does is be able to
have a joystick as well as usually a throttle that you can use to control flight type games or tank games where that you have one for rotation and one for movement. I mean, you could use them on other types of games as well, but that's primarily what they're for. So, taking a look inside of this, I'm wondering why, how was I able to get this one to stand? Aha! That's how. Look at that! You have angles. That's pretty awesome. I like that. So, continuing on in our bag of goodies here for the bonus things. What do we have? We have a spacer. The ProTube logoed with even Igor the War. Wrist straps. Love the attention to detail. It's pretty awesome. We have two different sizes of Allen wrench timber. Let's see, we have some plugs, it looks like. The ProTube VR sticker. An Igor ProTube VR. Feels like a decal or magnet. It is a magnet, just not very much magnetizing to it. It could also be a degaussing pad because of these magnets being so strong. So we have two of these spacers. We have a clip here. This is what goes inside of your controller at the bottom for the straps. These are really small. I'm not exactly sure what these are. We only have one of those, so I'm guessing it's because in case one breaks, we have a backup. Unless the kit got shorted, which is a possibility. So, let's take a look and see if we can loosen this one up. So it'll ratchet as well.
So far it won't. Still won't. There we go. All right. So now that one will be able to ratchet. I'm guessing this one is for the screws on top here so that this can be separated in case you wanted to put it on a railing system. Ah, there's the other one. Did not get shorted. I just didn't move it over with the other one. They have some of the best printing in the game, for sure, especially for Quest accessories. They're really durable. I almost thought that the uh, the recycle symbol there <laughs> was the ProTube symbol. It's a class 4 plastic. You are recyclable. So, let's uh, go ahead, put the spacers, the magnet, the sticker, and then you have the wrist straps that you would apply through these holes right here. on the bottom of the controller when it's not in the cup. The best thing and I can say the coolest thing about most of the ProTube VR accessories is once you have the cups for something, you have adaptability for most of their products. So if they offered like an upgrade pack that didn't include the cups but just the base product for people who already have the cups they could be able to have like a uh, an ecosystem for their sales of products that keeps track of you know who has ordered what and if they could then recommend we see that you already own the cups for this headset do you wish to just get the accessorial part opposed to getting cups again that way you can just you know swap out your cups to whatever uh, item you're using and you don't have to worry about anything that would uh, have to be extra weight on the shipment as well as extra cost and time of production because I would say that you know each cup takes longer to produce than you know these adapters here so I'm going to go ahead move the box over here on the side let's get 
the headset out of the dock. Ah. Now I'm in pass through mode. Okay, now I have my headset on, and I'm in pass-through mode. So, I can see. And you can see. So, you can see the, uh, the range with these, like if you had it stickered down, it would be a lot more stable, but I don't want to put it on my mat where that... This is an anti-static mat, and I don't want to uh, get any residue on it. So if I had a rail system for it to go on, then you could be able to see how this would be working for that purpose. So games like Star Wars Squadrons, Elite Dangerous, Endless Space, Battle Zone for Tanks, or possibly even other types of games that you wanted to use two joysticks essentially with, you could. I think that's pretty awesome. I'm going to take off the headset now. By the way, guys, I'm not currently using a uh, FrankenQuest uh, type of head strap, but I am still using the FrankenQuest loop here because this makes a huge difference in the amount of offset pressure on your face. Having this set higher takes the point of hot spots and pressure on your face to be a lot around here instead of here so just a little tip yeah that is uh that's the pro tube pro task for oculus quest 2 with the oculus quest 2 white cups and the pro tube pro grip straps which are the best knuckle grips or knuckle straps on the market, regardless of anything else, because the comfort for the extra padding that you get out of these. Let me just show you. You see how thick that is? And that is a velour type of material on the inside against your knuckles. These things are amazing. They do sell these just as a kit on their own as well. If you have the opportunity to ever get any ProTube products, you know, let them know thank you for the quality and the effort and the research and development that they put into designing all of this stuff. 
because they are truly gamers and they do care about comfort and actual functionality, just like the box says. You can see it's actually an insert serger seam on the sides of PU leather on the edges, so it gives a nice clean appearance. These have no trouble at all working on the stock Ocul Oculus Quest 2 battery panels. It's just where I'm using the non-stock Oculus Quest 2 timber. Oculus Quest 2 uh, Anker official battery charge deck or charge dock kit. They have an issue with those because of the transfer charging panels on the inside that are screwed on. So it, it makes it to where you have to offset to be able to get it to work. But I, I think uh, that says it all, guys. Just uh, feel the game. I think this one's a little bit loose. Well, more loose than I would care for. I'm going to get out this so we can adjust. It's pretty cool that the magnets are strong enough that, you know, bending like this doesn't actually cause it to come loose. You have to physically pull it away. Yeah, guys, um... If you have any questions or comments about this product or any other ProTube VR products, please feel free to uh, leave a comment below and I will answer to the best of my ability or contact ProTube myself or ask my housemate who has a lot more experience with them than I do in regards to any of the answers regarding your questions, you know. If you have any uh, desire to know whenever I have new content coming live, you know, consider subscribing to the channel. You uh, like this video and it gives you a little bit more informed of uh, purchasing idea or decisions, you know, feel free to give a thumbs up. And if you want to follow me on Twitter at Zybernight to know whenever I have new content, uh, possibly being new content uh, from items that arrive, you know, you're more than welcome to do so. And if this is not for you, then I'm sorry, you know, you're entitled to your own opinion. I'm just giving my stated experience on this. So I, I can't talk or speak to anything I've not actually used or experienced myself and the games that I play or anything else in that regard, so just uh, going to close up the box.
just like that. But, uh, yeah, guys, uh, Zyber Knight, the Tekken Games Crusader. Hope you guys have a good night, good day, take care, thanks for watching, thanks for sending the product for testing and review, ProTube. We'll see you later.